Hey everyone at Vinbook. Um, this is my producing partner, Neil Moritz. We're right in the middle of a meeting, and I know how much you guys like us to check in every now and then when we're at a meeting. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Well, what's going to happen with this? Well, probably the first time you guys will see what's really going to happen here is probably around Super Bowl. But we're probably going to do the biggest stunt we've, uh, we've ever done. you see this, guys? He just showed me a picture of these two skyscrapers in Abu Dhabi. By the way, Middle East, there are a few territories that broke every film record in history. 2D, 3D, didn't matter. It didn't matter what year it came out, it didn't matter how big it, a studio was, it didn't matter if it was a franchise that you knew, if it had a comic book or a book. Uh, there were a handful of territories, and it's growing, that have broken all previous film records in history. Uh, so there's so when we hear that as producers, we go, so the Middle East broke all records, huh? Yeah. Maybe we should try to find a way to do a scene in the Middle East. All right, yeah, we should check it out and, you know, and just never even been there but seen a lot of pictures and uh, now we visited. We were inspired by you. We were inspired by that reaction. We were inspired. We get inspired when you are inspired, when you're enthusiastic, when, you, when your country or your city or your region really comes out with this excitement, it inspires us. And sometimes we actually think about the location or the place, like for example, the Middle East, uh, all of you came to Israel, the highest re record numbers in history, Argentina, there's a handful, Greece, there's Trinidad. A, Trinidad, I mean, the list goes on, and look, we really do it, we don't stop doing it, we believe that we can reach higher, we feel the pressure always, and we, we meet that challenge. I just am like so happy that the movie has done so well, but most importantly, I'm just so happy that our fans have just loved the movie. You know, we were really confident that we made a great movie, but you never know until uh, the fans actually see it and traveling around the world with you and seeing the reaction. And then, God, last week, just reading so many emails and tweets about how people have gone and seen this movie the second time, a third time, and like even enjoyed it more <laughs> the second or third time than they did. Uh, the first time has been just so rewarding, I think, for all of us involved. You know, everybody put their heart and soul into this. And By the way, if you're seeing the movie for a second time this weekend, will you send a picture, take a picture of the theater, or take a picture of the line, or take a picture of the, ticket. the crowd, or the ticket, or something, and uh, send it back to celebrate with us? I, I actually, now that I've seen the movie probably 25 or 30 times, actually think the second time, third time, was my, was my favorite viewing. I just picked up on so okay. many little little details. Okay, of that, I, uh, I could see how that could happen actually because there's, the film is so dense. Yeah, like and that. just seeing how people, different people in different theaters react to different things is, That's true too. is uh, so rewarding. And I think it's truly one of these kind of popcorn movies that has a soul to it, where you go there and you get to just enjoy. Yeah, you know, it's it's just exactly what we what we set out to make. We know that Fast Six is is setting the bar really, really, really high. And we appreciate the challenge to wow you with Fast 7. As much as I was sitting there during the premiere of Fast 6 and enjoying the movie, enjoying the crowd reaction, what was really going through my head was, uh, God, the pressure's really on now <laughs> to make uh, 7 as good or better than 6. And uh, we are... Uh, not resting on our laurels. No, we, we, are, are not. we are determined to make it 